Hello, and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Marielle. Today we are going to cover what is essentially in these four cabinets and two drawers and two little cabinets. Right, right underneath the microwave, I keep a lot of supplies and a lot of this I never use. Okay, this, it actually works, but too lazy. <laughs> Stainless steel wipes. I've used it in the outside, and it actually does work. It, I used it for the um, rock guards. And again, it did work. I'm just too damn lazy. <sighs> Oven, use it off. I used to clean the oh I need to clean the oven <laughs> I used this to clean the the stove oh I need to clean the stove oh I need to clean this all right this is what I use <laughs> just spray it on let it sit and then wipe it so we'll leave that here goo gone uh, I never use this. Okay, that's not gonna go. Bleach, very useful for disinfecting. For bleach is very good for disinfecting the pipes. So this is what is under here. Clorox with bleach, very good. Uh, let's see, Clorox with bleach. What do I use this for? Oh yes, I use this for the cabinets. It brings them, makes them white again, which is wonderful. Ooh, God, that's dirty. I never looked at the cabinets from this perspective. I need, I need to clean. Okay, this stays here too. 409, disinfectant. Rodent spray, anytime I'm in a grassy area, I do spray this, and I guess I didn't use it that much. Uh, distilled vinegar, very good disinfectant also. Okay, this is backup. I don't even know what this is. Oh! This is backup Jeffron, which is banana sauce it's Filipino ketchup and this is back up low sodium soy sauce again I use these beer bottle cozies they work really well for protecting glass okay that can stay Okay, this one is where I keep a lot of bug spray. Rubber seal protectant. This I use for the windows so that they open easier. T9, very good lubricant. Use it all around the trailer for um, the doors, the drawers, anything that requires metal to metal contact. Again, a lot of bug spray a lot of bug spray okay this is the bug spray that works for me it's called proven works really well so well that I, I put it in a spray bottle and I mix what's in here? Oh, and I mix DEET with it 100% DEET I need to go through these drawers more often. I'm carrying a lot of stuff that I need to be carrying. Uh, oh, needs to be cleaned back here. Uh, uh, okay, I 
didn't even know I had extras. Okay, and I also need to clean that. Oh. Okay, let's just close it up for now. <laughs> okay, this cat, this drawer here, the one in the middle. Uh, chives, I'm out. Oh, this is wonderful. Tabasco peppers. Garlic salt and pan and the rest are just utensils wooden spoons Oops. thongs spatula. this is wonderful if, when you have um, ground beef or ground pork you mash it in there can opener strainer beer. oh wine Wine opener, very important. Garlic. Oh, wood. Okay, that's what I keep in this drawer. It's all going. And the top drawer, lastly, are utensils. Scissor. This is the only knife I really use. Chef's knife. Can't. What's this called? <laughs> box box cutter. That's what this is called. <laughs> okay, this is what I use to open the windows with from the outside. I just slip slip it through the crack and then I go all the way around it. And of course, a lighter for candles. I carry four, a set of four spoons, forks, and knives. And also chopsticks. Now I use the square chopsticks. They're square, so when set them down in the rig they don't roll I used to have the circular ones and when I was sitting at the table they would roll because the trailer is not always even so I went to the square chopsticks these are stainless steel okay this is coffee perfect scoop for coffee sometimes I, I do mount it up a little bit stronger cup of coffee this is for cleaning the Yeti straws. So you go in there and clean it. What is this called? Clothespin? Did one fall out? No, it's still up there. Okay, that clothespin is used for the drying mat that I can dry the mat with. And of course, a knife sharpener. All right, that's what I keep in those four compartments. And probably when I get back and start sorting everything, less will probably go back in. Like a lot of the utensils, I never use them. So I'm only gonna keep the ones that I actually use. That might be another episode, things that I actually put back for the fifth year of owning this rig. Thank you for watching, bye.